Sweet Talk started in 2002, started by my father. It is a family business. During that point in time, it was the first bubble tea craze where everybody was selling at five, six dollars per cup. So Sweet Talk saw the opportunity during the economy downturn to offer bubble tea at economical and reasonable prices at about one, two dollars. That's how we managed to survive over the years and we are still going strong now. Throughout the years, Sweet Talk maintains its philosophy of offering bubble tea at value for money and reasonable prices. So our customers are able to buy our bubble tea every day. It's like a every day you can drink, everybody can buy bubble tea. We believe in treating our employees right and leading by example. So for instance, when our employees fall sick, our company actually send them medicine and uh, ask about their well-being. Also, our bosses actually lead by example. For instance, uh, my father himself, when our driver is sick, he will actually take over the driver's role to deliver. And for me, when our outlet is uh, short-handed, I will actually go down to the outlet to help out. So by doing so, we lead by example and this instills a lot of loyalty in our employees. Hence, they will recommend their friends to join our company and this is how we retain our pool of talented and loyal employees. In the SMB Consulting Program, I work with a group of uh, three MBA students, Ellen, Alvin and Fiona. So being MBA students and working professionals, they are very professional, very experienced and very task-oriented. Uh, I would say that they are the dream team because their skill sets complement each other and they brought a lot of value add to the project with their working experience. Frankly speaking, being MBA working professionals, I was quite worried about their time commitment at the start. However, throughout the project, they exceeded my expectations by going the extra mile for every task. For instance, even though the survey results were quite conclusive in my opinion, they still made the extra effort to conduct focus group to find out more about qualitative responses on a Saturday in their own free time. Their recommendations reaffirm Sweet Talk's business plans going forward. Their recommendations were divided in three phases. So for phase number one, for the short term period, uh, they recommended implementing sugar level, which we should have done long time ago. Also, we will be uh, implementing the POS system for our future outlets to gather more data for our future use. To cater to a growing segment of people who are looking for more premium drinks, we have launched Sweet Talk Signature earlier this year. To date, we have two outlets, one at Pioneer MRT and the other one at Aogang One. From here, we will implement most of the recommendations that the team has proposed. Overall, I'm very satisfied with the project and I would definitely recommend the SME Consulting Program to all businesses.